Hi, my name's Chris. I'm Head of Digital at Kurt Geiger. My role involves leading a number of different teams, uh, all with their own expertise and focusing on delivering our digital strategy. Um, what I'm primarily focused on is delivering a really great user experience for the customer, uh, showcasing our brand through our digital channels and our international expansion. My first role working in retail was actually on the foods to go section uh, in Manchester. And my job was to keep it like well stocked, make sure it was well presented and to log any early sellouts. So that was the start of my career and obviously, yeah, it was, it was great fun. So um, I, I joined m at the start of my career and I did a variety of different roles, uh, working up to a store manager, all of them which was a really good experience and working in different parts of the UK, uh, predominantly based around the Manchester region. Um, I think one of the great parts of that was just the customer facing element of the job, uh, which you kind of take with you through your retail career. Uh, and when an opportunity did come up to work in head office, it was for a uh, online website role uh, for the MS Homeware Trading Manager. So at that point, um, I interviewed for it and then I packed my things up and kind of moved down to London. Um, I had some really good years working at MS and took the decision to work at Topshop Topman. Um, similar kind of trading roles, but uh, really focused obviously on a younger customer and the uh, head office kind of, you know, the vibe there at the time was it was a lot of fun to work there. Uh, really talented to people to work with and I really enjoyed my time there. Uh, and then two years ago, I moved to Kurt Geiger. I've been incredibly grateful to work uh, for Kurt Geiger, uh, especially during this period. Um, we've got really strong brand values, an amazingly talented team, and a clear strategy for profitable growth. Early on in my career, the then CEO visited uh, my store in his first week at MS, and it was a really great privilege to kind of walk him through the store, introduce him to the staff, and just show him what we're doing. Um, much more recently, we've been really focused on growing our international uh, business at Kurt Geiger. So when I was over in LA last month launching our new warehouse, it just felt like a really fantastic milestone for the business um, and a real platform for, for us to grow from there. So I usually start my day by checking the numbers uh, and running through the priorities with my team. Uh, we talk about what decisions need making, what the focus is on for that day uh, and any support that anyone needs. And often needs to be, for me, it needs to be a balance of both the short term day to day trading uh, and then switching my head into kind of projects or work decisions that require longer term uh, planning and creative thinking. So uh, working in digital, there's a number of different functions. Um, some of those uh, and probably the ones that I focus on are more the front end to the customer. So you've got your digital marketing team that's responsible for the paid channels uh, and getting the people to the website. You've got the trading team uh, that's really fo focused on conversion op rate optimization. So once those people come to the site, really about getting the convert and obviously driving the sales. Uh, we've got a design team who are responsible for the look and feel uh, and also the user experience that you have when you uh, come onto the site. And importantly, a production team who are responsible for getting all of that content uploaded and showing it to you and presenting it to the way that's acceptable and, and it works for the customer on the website. Um, the other aspect of the team is the studio. So on average, you know, we're photographing hundreds of products every week, um, both for the Kurt Geiger website and for all of our partner websites. So that could be like Selfridges, Harrods, Farfetch. Um, so we shoot to a specific set of needs for each of those sites, uh, obviously to a high standard. And, you know, that could be priced on anything from a kind of a uh, 50 pound pairs of shoes to a, a pair of shoes, you know, in the thousands of pounds. The best part of my job is definitely working with the amazingly talented people uh, that work in digital uh, and also new technology. I think obviously that doesn't just impact on retail but it impacts on all different aspects of our lives day to day and it's you know it's a rapidly changing industry and there are always new learning opportunities and I often find that working in digital you're applying things to both retail but also many other industries uh, that exist as well. And I think that's that's the other thing I'd say about working in digital is some of those skills that you acquire are, are cross industry and it gives you a lot of flexibility in terms of your career and, and where you want to go to uh, in terms of your career path. The most challenging part of my job is definitely prioritising all the different projects, different deadlines and really 
putting my time into the best use. Um, we're constantly trying to evolve our digital experience and as our competitors, right? So it's not only what we're doing, but keeping up with the pace of change. And there's, you know, whether it's the social media apps that you use or it's the different interfaces that you kind of connect with on a day to day, we're always trying to provide an experience that is in line with our customers' expectations and like pleases and delights in terms of what they see and how they use it. So I think one of the great things about working about Kurt Geiger is uh, your ability to kind of influence and, and get involved in day-to-day -day decision making and, and, and drive the business forward from that. I've previously worked in quite big businesses, whether it's kind of uh, Arcadia or M&S. And the amazing thing that I felt when I came to Kurt Geiger was it's a relatively flat hierarchy. There's an opportunity for everyone to speak, everyone to give their ideas and to drive a difference and a positive change within the business. And I think if you come with that mentality, then you can progress and, and, and do really well. I started working with the FRA about 18 months ago. Um, and when I think back over the course of my career today, um, I've had you know, whether I've known it or not at the time, certainly guidance and support from some key people that's helped made a real positive influence for me. Um, and so really I wanted to try and pass some of that support on uh, and hopefully achieve that with working with some of the um, students at the FRA. I started working on the two year degree, degree programme with a, uh, a student called Zoe. Uh, my role there was really just to provide some support um, and I think uh, really how we made a success of that was uh, we met up fairly regularly. Um, I support with Zoe with some of uh, her, um, her projects and in particular her final project which was really uh, around uh, Kurt Geiger and how they could recycle and offer a uh, recycled range. Um, it was absolutely fantastic to work with Zoe. I thought she showed kind of great initiative, really hard working and I actually got a lot out of it as well. Um, over the course of the 18 months, obviously, we were able to provide Zoe with a work placement. Uh, and as we did that, um, it was clear that she would be a great fit for Kurt Geiger. And uh, she was actually offered a full-time role in the marketing team. Mm -hmm.